About you. I'm gonna want the photo. I agree. <laughs> the way he just like one clips everybody is like I played against controller players, but Effect is just out of this world. Effect is the most feared controller player because he just kills everyone. <laughs> The team has been preparing for this land by just playing a lot of Apex. There was a whole new meta shift and we basically spent the entire split figuring out how we wanted to play the game. You basically have to relearn the game again and just figure out all the small details. We basically have a very stable and uh, synergized team. We have all the necessary components that you need in Apex to succeed. We are in the perfect position. I think others expect the best for us, but they don't want us to win. They know how we play. They know what we represent. I feel like other teams for Alliance, because if it isn't us, who else is it? It's either us or them. So um, we have a lot to prove, but we'll see. Taking you guys into the uh, back rooms. Backstage. Not the real back rooms, I hope. <laughs> <laughs> this is B stage, where we train, the warm up. <laughs> Our booth is down here. There we go. What are these? What are, what are you opening right now? These nuts. Hello everyone! We are here with all our merch and also fan items. He's always getting taken away. Oh no! He's taking over your role, Yuki! Yeah. <laughs> no, you must be a bit relieved. You must be a bit relieved. Yeah. <laughs> I'm really excited to play my first LAN. For me, coming into this team, next to Hakus and Yuki, I feel like a baby. They are 10 years older than me and they just know way more than me. They pretty much tell me about everything. I'm just like a kid who is in the school and getting taught. Well, you have West Ham, Arsenal, Chelsea, Tottenham, Everton, right? In London. I have no clue, mate. I don't even know watch football. <laughs> I really appreciate Hakus and Yuki. Like, they treat me very well, especially Yuki. He's like my older brother to me. What do you say in the pack? Hmm? Big boy now. This is the big league, this is where you belong. You know what I'm saying? I told you before though, you've shown these guys a thousand times. A thousand times. Let's do it one more time, you know what I'm saying? Yep. One more time. Easy class. They're scared of you, by the way. They're not scared of them, they're scared of you. <laughs> Play the drums. Come effect, this is your first Alliance huddle. It's a beautiful moment right there. The only thing I want to say is that every single team in this LAN have earned their spot here. And that means that we're going to show them respect in the lobby by shitting on them. But we have to go into every single team fight with full focus. We have our comms, we have our confidence and we have our awareness in all of the fights that we're doing. Uh, what we, what we told, talked a little bit about on bootcamp was just that you guys just need to communicate with each other. Like, no one can read their minds. When you communicate with each other, you're the best team in the world. One, it's two, three, baby or we're gonna... Baby, baby one, baby, baby one. one. Baby yeah. one. Can't have oh, well, yeah. well, loud one, so I hear it. <laughs> one, two, it's three. three right. Right. Yeah. Nice, boys. That's oh, actually right. a really good ult. It sucked them out and around the shield. Oh, the alliance. Oh, my God. Oh. Effect's in there. God. Effect is in there like swimmer, baby. There's Tide no goes down. This kid is so damn good, bro. Oh my god! Oh my Hackers! Come on, baby! And now we have a two versus three versus one. As Yuki is just gonna be hiding away and maybe trying to escape. And we'll push on the task, but he's gonna try and take second place. He'll do so, Yuki! Does it for a line! If someone's gonna be alive, let it be your crypto player. We have seen more crypto resets than anything in Alliance running in this difficulty. See your IGL for the team, typically in an anchor position, but Effect doubles down and takes out North Action. Look, they arrive to the zone and Alliance denies.
denied them entry. Single left, single left. 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 I think other teams expect pretty much the same thing that I do. Being on LAN is like a buff. The game just feels better in general. And if you're in the right mental state, then you also play better. So a lot of teams are going to be afraid and we can abuse that. They had control of the building. They were the ones that slipped up. That's going to be tough for them. And it's evidently going to be tough for Dark Zero, who have lost a member to, you guessed it, an effect. And Yuki does have the ability to pop in. Horizon all goes in as well. And in fact, the effect, effect takes out MD YY. How is that even possible right there? That was so insanely quick. We've seen this fight. This is how the split one playoffs ended. And who comes out on top again? GSM from above take out Ascend. They secure second place and they know what they did. But Yuki gets taken down and the tides begin to turn with Furholz, perhaps Fuller. <laughs> It is two perfectly placed grenades. He is full of confidence! Full of beans, but unfortunately that means that there's going to be Alliance above and they will get involved with this fight and they just have to nade, nade, nade. Black Hole comes down as well. The inevitable is going to happen. Alliance are going to do it again. It is easy as that. Alliance pick up the win and they show us just why they are one of the teams that really are on fire this tournament. <laughs> So today's just been great. I've never seen the team this confident before. Today they just played out of their minds. Even if we were tired, when we were uh, like back against the wall, we still managed to pull through and really just show up and show them that we are one of the best teams in the world, if not the best. Tomorrow we're facing a team that's landing on one of our drop spots. So we're gonna throw them out the door. Game plan. Does everybody have seven hours? Yes, mine's on right now. Yeah, yeah. Save some points for the rest of them. It might it might be nice. We will. We will save some, some, some points right now. We're gonna give it to them. I picked you guys against my team to watch. Yes. <laughs> no solo shit. Play together. So we need to do medium alliance into it. Medium alliance. No, yeah, small alliance, small alliance. Small alliance. Baby, baby, baby alliance. One, two, two three. three. Alliance! They want to get into a fight, they said actually this is a perfect drop for us, it's a 3v3 brawl! Oh it's a 3v3 brawl but it's very one-sided at the moment and Alliance is saying, where did you come from? Maybe you should have stuck to the, uh, the plan of the first game, effects will fall. Less. And Fury decides, maybe that wasn't the best of ideas and Alliance are giving the beans! Where's the camera, bro? Where's the camera? <laughs> but it is going to finish on the other side of that wall. But for Riddle, they just want to avoid contact for as long as possible. As now here comes Alliance of the Dark Fair. Dark Fair goes down. Alliance know they have to swing. They have to try and take this space. If they get one, if Fangs gets two, he almost gets them all. As Hackett is now left on his own, they can take to the skies. They use the grab lift themselves, and surely this is set up for them to take this home. Should, but it's not always a guarantee oh. when you're against the Lions. Hackett! Hackett and Yuki as a two against one here, and it looks like it could still be a Lions' escape. Hackett and Yuki turn the fight on its head, and they put a Lions once again <laughs> as the team we call champions here in game number two. They are unstoppable, it would seem. Can Alliance and 
can Yuki follow up on this? Well, they managed to force Riddler away from the rest of the teams as well, isolate this fight, which is great news for Alliance. Now the attention is away. Hackers can move in. There's 90, and there's the knock. Alliance continue to just run through the lobby. They lose all the abilities they would use in this fight oh for 10 Lord. seconds, thanks to a focus of attention. And oh that one, my God. one, two, go down. It's just up to Zane. 12 seconds on Zane's gravity lift, but only five left oh, for the low ground that. in Alliance. Zane is getting pushed, and he is getting pushed yesterday. As a result, the drop He's comes get it off. through. He He's doesn't. trying to get away. I know no. gravity lift goes down, but you cannot escape the fact. Alliance are up on top in the middle of a fight effect, trying to stave off oh. any damage with the Prowler. It's simple. One, two, three, four, five effect. Leans one more up. And even the best that South America has to offer can up against Alliance. It is destruction Ooh. from on high with Hackis raining down Glitch around. Playing in front of a crowd feels amazing. Every event so far, they have been amazing and it's been super fun just talking to people, taking pictures and overall just great vibes. I'm very excited to meet new people and new supporters as well. Because uh, every split, I'm sure there's a lot of new supporters who come in. I want to take pictures of a lot of people and um, <laughs> sign their controllers. Oh my god, perfect. You're a fucking demon, honestly. You played so well. This, this uh, land shit really is easier than you thought, huh? It's so good. <laughs> if you would like to leave, you can. But just so you know, we have a line upstairs that goes all the way to the back of the building over there. So if you want to leave once this section is done, you can, but you can also stay because there's still more fans at one time. That was a long one. It's only three signatures. <laughs> Nobody came over to me. Hackers and effects got all everyone. That was my third one of the day. Yuki Gang, also get yours. On controller? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> there are in the controller, bro. Yeah. <laughs> you will get the aim assist. You don't get to touch it yourself. <laughs> <laughs>going into the winner's bracket we obviously felt a lot of confidence having the group stage that we had but we were still hungry we have to keep the confidence up and we have to just keep going all right just want to say hi good luck for the games today have fun it's been a joy watching you guys and it's really cool to have you all on land so i'm uh, just here to enjoy the show nothing more than that good to have you here. good to have me here <laughs> true we'll give you a shout we're doing legs the only thing I'm gonna say is we are the best team in this tournament. We fucking are. And you have shown it in groups. You have shown it. Excuse <laughs> <laughs> <gonna> me. <laughs> Who? And today? <laughs> and today? We're gonna show it again. We're gonna show it again. By being the best team. By being the best team. And we're gonna fuck everyone. We're gonna fuck everyone. <laughs> this looks a bit too easy for Alliance, I've gotta say. The opening damage comes in and realize kind of fall a little bit flat and that might actually help him so he gets the boost as if you need to make it any easier for him Here we go. The boy coming on in. Fnatic going down. Dark Zero going down. Obstacle going out. Alliance TSM. now with the walk up here. TSM dying. Alliance, Alliance reclaiming the throne. And Alliance takes the win. And there we go. They're jumping all around. Alliance with the W in game number six. That's huge for Alliance. Maybe because they're going to get some extra points going into finals. Last game. <laughs> Signing card for you, sir. I'm good, I'm good. All right, all right. So you know Alliance? You know Alliance, bro? I've heard of them. Of course, nobody's. Oh, okay, okay. <laughs> uh, okay. Any special strategies going into tomorrow, or what are you guys doing tonight? Same shit, yeah. Same shit, different day. Different day. Just no more trolley. 
Everything trolls. Winning the LDS playoffs would mean the world to me. It's a price of showing how much work you put into the game and all the effort that you've put in. I feel like everything we've done so far has led up to this point. And if we win it, it just shows that all the work we've put in has been rewarded. In the grand finals, I think that the boys finally got to see the other side of Apex when you don't really get all the zones. Everyone is just faster at rotating and all that stuff. Yeah, it didn't go away, but we still are very confident for the championship and we are gonna bring it. Still not playing perfect. We making results, but like in my opinion, we could have done something different that would have worked out and that would be ten times better than what we did. So we still have room to improve. In terms of results of this event, I've always had the mindset that anything but a win is a loss. So just gotta go next, you know, until we get the trophy. Thank you all for sticking with us, showing your support. It means the world to us. We're just gonna go back home and keep on the grind. The grind does not end until champs us. Thank you very much everybody for coming to support us. It means a lot. Without you guys, we wouldn't even exist. And it's always good to show and prove that we play for something and for someone, which is you guys. And you guys having a smile on your face gives us a smile on our faces. So thank you very much.